What is up guys? Welcome back to another video here on Redline Nation Racing. Um, it's Wood Tick. First night of Wood Tick here up at Merritt Speedway. Uh, it's, it's what we've been waiting for all year. It's the biggest race of the year here in Michigan by far. Um, night one here, it's the Thurlby Throwdown. Um, we're here with Matt Morosky again. Uh, I think we're racing for 2000 tonight. And a guaranteed starting spot in Saturday's main event, paying 36000 to win. So uh, tonight is an invitational race. Um, only drivers that haven't won at Merritt or Tri-City can run this race. So Matt fits into that category, and we're going to try our best to change change that status tonight. Um, hopefully walk out of here with a win, and we'll see what happens. Also, real quick, before we get too far into the video, I did have a couple people I wanted to thank uh, for making this trip possible. Um, first and foremost, Cars Auto Repair, as always. Uh, they sponsored the GoPro, so huge thank you to them. Couldn't be where we are without them. Um, and then coming on board for this weekend is uh, Acord Farmstead Creations. Uh, Barb, she, uh, she makes awesome stuff. She makes cups, shirts, stickers, uh, just any kind of little trinkets type stuff that you guys could could use uh, i'm not too sure exactly what it all is i'm going to look into it a little bit more and i will let you guys know in tomorrow's video um but get a hold of barb at, uh, at their facebook page i'm going to link that right in here somewhere um but huge thank you to huge thank you to them for coming on board for the weekend and helping make this trip possible all right guys here's a look at the car the Morosky 09 Got the Cars Auto Repair GoPro on there, ready to go for tonight. Be rolling out in a little bit. All right, guys, Matt's got a merch tent set up. Come see his girlfriend, Elena, for all the Matt Morosky merch. James Harris has got some hats here, too. And we got stickers. Come see Elena. All right, guys, here with Matt. Here, first night of Wood Tick for the Thoroughby Throwdown Invitational. What do you think, Matt? Now we're here and we're ready, so it can be better. How's the track look for the for tonight at least? It's pretty wet right now. I think she's probably gonna blow off pretty quick, and I'm sure it'll be rough. So we'll find out. You got a plan in mind for if that does happen? Hopefully we can get through the holes and be at the front. All right, well, we'll see how it goes. guys that was a uh, that was qualifying we're uh we're looking real good right now at least uh quick time in our group with a 13 6 something not exactly sure what but uh i know we're third quick overall quick time in our group so we're on the right track so far hopefully we can keep it this way and uh we'll talk to matt in a few minutes to see what he thinks all right matt quick time in your group what do you think how'd the car feel uh, we're pretty good the car felt good not good enough for quick time but we're working our group and we'll see what we can do in the heat race, start fourth, so. We got a plan for uh, what the track's gonna do and what we're gonna do with the car? Yeah, we make a few adjustments and I guess we're just gonna try it. We can only go forward. Yeah, sounds good. We'll start fourth in the heat race. How are you gonna get by everybody? Hopefully quick, fast. 
Started fourth in the heat race, finished third. Uh, not exactly where we wanted to be, but about not much you can do when they invert like that. And we just couldn't pass, so they're making some adjustments. Matt said that he couldn't get around on the bottom very well, um, and as you guys can see, we were hitting that hole going into three there. Uh, messed up the nose a little bit, so they're working on that right now. Uh, but we'll be rolling out for the feature here in a little while. I'm not exactly sure where we start yet, uh, but I'll let you guys know. Um, and we'll talk to Matt here in a little bit when he's less busy and uh, find out what he thinks on the car so far. Stay tuned, guys. All right, Matt, we started fourth and finished third in the heat race. What happened out there? Yeah, track was a little rougher on the top. I couldn't get around the bottom as good as some guys were. They are pretty good, but Made a few changes and hopefully we can roll around the bottom and gain some positions. Probably gonna be starting eight or nine, so we'll see what we can do. That hole that was down there going into three, that looks pretty rough. Uh, is there just not, not much of a way around that to hit a good line? No, not if you're trying to hit the top. The line, that hole is just pretty deep. Took out the nose a little bit, but we got her fixed up. All right, by my math, we should be starting eighth in the feature. You got a plan to get up, uh, up towards the front, hopefully? Hopefully, let's kind of, hopefully we can get around on the bottom, it'll be good. If not, probably won't be so hot. All right, well, good luck. All right, guys, so a uh, little miscommunication between somebody, uh, but turns out we were supposed to be in the redraw, but they only called for the top two over the loudspeaker, so we didn't go to the front stretch to do the redraw. Um, so they came back to us and Matt redrew the sixth. So rather than starting eighth, like we thought, we will start sixth in the feature tonight. Uh, not, not terrible. 
So we uh, will be rolling off from six. Hopefully we can get up to the front. You guys stay tuned. We'll be rolling out here in just a few minutes.
was uh, pretty unfortunate. Matt ran hot uh, after hitting all those bumps. Track's really rough, really rough, especially over in three and four. So uh, he pulled off because it got hot. We're gonna save it for tonight. And uh, we'll, we'll get, a, get her ready for tomorrow, get the nose fixed, because he popped the nose back up again and running through those bumps. Uh, but we'll get her fixed up. I'm gonna go over here so you guys can hear me better. But yeah, we'll get her fixed up for the night, back in the trailer, and we'll unload it tomorrow, hopefully ready to go. Um, we'll talk to Matt, see what he says, and finish this video up. This video will be going out tomorrow. I think I'm gonna stay up a little bit late and edit it tonight so I can get up early in the morning, drive it to town and upload it. And uh, we'll, uh, we'll have this video out real quick, thanks to Cars Auto Repair for uh, the GoPro. I did break the GoPro case, but I, I ended up stopping on my way up here and grabbing a spare. So I got another one for tomorrow. We're, we're good on that. Um, other than that, we will be running it again tomorrow, night two. I think 3,000 to win tomorrow. So also thank you to Acord Farmstead Creations. Uh, get a hold of Barb there for any of your little uh, cups and stickers and wood carvings and stuff like that um, and she can do really good work for you so we'll we'll talk to Matt and finish this video up here in a few minutes all right Matt tell us what happened tonight now we we're running pretty good we hit a track was pretty rough and we hit a hole on that restart and uh, she caved the nose in which uh, kind of we couldn't drive it after that then it yeah, she wasn't letting the air under. She started running a little warm, so decided to pull off and play it safe. So we'll try again tomorrow. What all do we got to do to get this thing ready for tomorrow? Well, we'll have to fix the nose and figure out something different. If the tracks are off, I'm sure they'll do the same thing. So we'll get her ready. Got adjustments we got to make? We got a, anything in mind particularly? Uh, probably going to leave it. Probably put her back to how we had her today. We'll try it. All right, well, good luck tomorrow and uh, get a run tonight. All right, guys, um, we're back at the car. I had fun tonight, night one here for the Thoroughby Throwdown at Merritt Speedway for the first night of Wood Tick. Um, that's gonna do it for tonight's video. Uh, unfortunately, we had the car overheat, so we had to shut her down. Um, we're gonna get the car ready for tomorrow though. We gotta fix the nose because uh, the holes were pretty deep. Uh, but we're gonna get it ready for tomorrow and run night two. I think we're racing for three grand tomorrow. Um, but gotta give a huge thank you to a couple people for making this possible. Cars Auto Repair um, for sponsoring the GoPro for the year. That, that has been a huge help, having that GoPro. Uh, performance is better, uh, convenience is better, just being able to change batteries. I couldn't do that on my old one. Um, so it should, that's been a huge help. So thank you, thank you to Cars Auto Repair out of Astor, Michigan. If you guys need anything done on your cars, take it there uh, if you're in that area. Um, and then uh, Acord Farmstead Creations. Uh, Barb does awesome work. If you guys need any, uh, she does like tumbler cups, uh, insulated cups, the ones with the straw in them and everything, um, wood engravings, uh, like wood burning stuff. She does really cool, uh, like pictures and stuff on them. She can put just about anything you want on them. She does some uh, decals, I, th I think, some stickers. Um, just get a hold of her, see what she does. I'm gonna link her Facebook in the description of the video. Um, I'm gonna put something along the screen, like I said earlier, so you guys can see what it is. Um, so go check that out, see what she does. Get a hold of her to get some, get some stuff. If you're out of Michigan or far from the Caro or Vassar, Michigan area, you might have to pay for it to get shipped, but uh, I'd imagine she can get it to you pretty cheap, so. 
uh, get a hold of her for any of those needs. And thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like the video, comment, and let us know. Let us know what you think of the night so far. Um, let us know how Matt did, and tell him tell him good job, and we'll get him tomorrow. And uh, don't forget to subscribe. It helps us out a lot. It's completely free for you guys. And uh, share the video with some friends. Let's get it out there a little bit and uh, grow this channel a little bit more. And I, uh, I greatly appreciate you guys for watching the video. We're going to wrap it up and uh, get ready for tomorrow. Thanks for watching, guys. Mm -hmm.